hard spot to be in that I'm in with this political stuff because at the end of the day, the brass tacks are is you can't handle the truth and you're not willing to fight for the truth and you want to deny the truth. And people like me, okay, have been taken right off the street, okay, and beat up by police. Fuck you, you're going to hear it. And then thrown in jail and then prosecuted in a judicial system that denies the truth and facts and the evidence and allows corruption to ensue using the clerk courts and everything and all the people that are basically you, the voters. And you want to tell me you know what's best for the country when you only think about it once every four years? Okay? And you listen to code enforcement push you around for things that your parents didn't have to deal with that cost your parents stuff? And then you inherit and then you got a, an opinion? You don't, you don't live the same life. And for the one, she opens the borders. Uh, I mean, she's on the team that opens the borders, okay? That does things like attack certain, certain monies that's sitting there for the older people, okay? And, and the things about the treatment of the veterans and all this stuff like that. So that's a disgrace to America as it is. And the other guy, he's telling people that, you know, and he's saying he wants to federalize police and he doesn't complain about the courts on our behalf, but lets everybody complain that they're bad on his behalf. And all the people that are complaining, oh, the courts aren't treating Trump fair. What the fuck did you do when your own fucking blood brother sitting there working the same fucking slave fields every day he gets plucked off the street and put in jail or harassed by the police and phone calls and 911 calls are made about me and lies and the police come after me and your piece of shit state's attorney and fucking mayor don't even do shit. Where the fuck were you then? So it's all the same for me because it's at the point of presentation. So you push your fucking button and you judge me how you want. But at the end of the day, you ain't shit to me because you don't have a fucking American flag in your pocket and you're condemning me. And what you do affects me. And you didn't do nothing because I'm 50 fucking years old. And if you're older than me and you're telling me about voting and maybe you should have made it so the votes count. Maybe you should have made it so I couldn't get plucked off the street like your kids. Okay? Thrown in fucking jail for no reason. And you want to tell me about voting and you want to underpay me and go spend money on guns? I'll be plucking them off your dead motherfucking body to defend myself because you're on the front line with your prosecution and your vote. So Fuck you. I'm voting for me and us while you vote for a celebrity, you motherfuckers and bitches. How do you like me now? So you can condemn me for not wanting to vote. But I'm a registered Republican. And if somebody steals your vote, you won't even know it. And you don't even know about your rights. You didn't even fucking file. Remember that. I vote for us, and I vote for America, and I vote for me. Who the fuck are you voting for? Really?